Hello everyone, this is College Girl and uh, now I am with part 2 of Casio Basic Calculations and I have here first decimal, hexadecimal, octal and binary. So I am going to do calculations using these number systems and we have those in here decimal, hexadecimal, binary and octal but we don't we can't access them when it is in uh, comp mode so we need to change the mode to base because every number system it has uh, a base number decimal has 10 hexadecimal has 16 octal has 8 and binary has 2 so now it is an octal number and i want to convert a number uh, some octal number to binary hexadecimal and decimal uh, you know that octal numbers are from 0 to 7 so i'm giving 25 and when i press equal to it would go to answer and when i press binary uh, thus is the value of uh, 25 in octal in binary so when i press hexa it is 15 25 in octal is 15 in hexa and when i press binary it's 21 so uh, this is how we convert uh, uh, num uh, number systems using a cashew and now we are going to see how to delete a number that you have saved uh, already saved in your uh, cashew I have shown you how to save a number in your cashew previously but there is a thing that I didn't say that is uh, when you save a number it would only be stored in your cashew for three days uh, and uh, if your cashew is new and there is no damage that uh, that is done to it that means it's not dropped and anything so it may store for one week but most of the cashews as the aging i mean as you uh, use it uh, for some time it would its capacity would be for three days so i have uh, saved a number in m last time so here is my number uh, it's still there so i am going to delete it like i'm going to make that number a zero last time i have shown you how to save a number this is same as that but i'm going to save a number zero because zero is like nothing so zero equal to that means zero would be in answer and shift rcl m see here there is no m means there is no value in your uh, m position of your cashew and i have also saved in a see that so i'm also going to delete it but you won't know i mean you won't have any indication in here to say that uh, it is uh, already deleted other than zero and arrow a so yes that is how to delete a number and type a name it's very silly i know but uh, uh, when uh, in college like during classes we can't have a phone or we can't uh, uh, write a message on your notes and pass it to your friends so when it can be done using your cashew here see there are some letters uh, by using these we can write some little words uh, to pass little, little messages or so so uh, i'm going to write manu so when you need to write a letter if it's in yellow you would uh, uh, use shift if it's in pink you would use alpha if uh, there is nothing in here you should need to use from you need to get that letter from here so here is the instruction constant uh, there are these r can be accessed from 0 1 to 4 0 here it is i'm going to use them and shift and uh, alpha and the letters here now i'm going to use them shift m I mean shift 7 would be m alpha a m a and n here is n shift n and shift n m a n n u i need u but here is mu uh, if we don't have u we can use mu so first uh, uh, search for u and here it is 17 
so we need to press constant and 17 so there manu like that we can pass messages little little ones uh, but when you press uh, equal to it shows error means it can't be stored because uh, numbers would be needed and uh, it's not necessary so yeah delete it next complex operations i want to convert a complex number to a polar form so i have a real uh, real number plus i into some imaginary number equal to so he, it shows a real number and when you shift equal to it shows the imaginary number now you want to convert it to polar form so shift here it is r angle polar form so angle equal to that's the angle that's the polar form please do subscribe to my channel and college girl signing off